Kicking off this election year after months of campaigning, the first in the nation, Iowa caucuses. Sub-zero temperatures and blustery winds still slamming the Hawkeye state. GOP frontrunner Donald Trump rallying Sunday, downplaying the weather. Uh, it's all indoors, so you're not going to have to worry about that. The former president who faces 91 criminal charges, imploring his supporters to deliver him a decisive victory. The big event at 7 o'clock. And hopefully we're going to have some tremendous numbers. Trump holding a dominant 28-point lead in a new Des Moines Register NBC News poll. Nikki Haley and Ron DeSantis now in a heated race for second place. Haley with our really Eva Pilgrim. What I love about the poll is I was the only one going up and everybody else was going down. So. Haley canceling an event Sunday with DeSantis nearby, still in person, pushing the idea that he, not Haley, is the only candidate who can beat Trump. She cannot win conservative or poor voters, uh, Republicans. She's trying to win, you know, people in the other party. In Des Moines, his supporters going door to door trying to win over new voters as his poll numbers decline. Got another one. Arkansas Governor Asa Hutchinson still in the race but polling in the single digits, criticizing the other presidential hopefuls for not aiming their attacks at Trump. Candidates that think they're going to win without taking on Donald Trump, uh, they're, they're behind 28 points in the polls. So uh, we'll see what strategy works. The caucuses begin tonight with the power to reshape a presidential race. Here in the media room, media outlets from across the globe will be able to see results and report them out in real time. M1, ABC News, Des Moines, Iowa.